watching like a lot of um, drag queen videos recently. <laughs> I don't know, maybe it's giving me body image issues. Like they're so pretty and all the uh, scientific uh, and biological answers that I was born here. Which apparently people don't know. Some people think I'm from China. Maybe it's because my name is just two words. Like, my full name is T. Zhuo, uh, and uh, I'm from the class of 2018. Well, like every good Asian family, I was enrolled into an abacus class. This was like all the rage, like when I was growing up. And the, t the teacher was like uh, giving out uh, snacks for like people who had done, done well. And I done well. Um, and like she asked, oh, has everyone had breakfast? Um, if not, like you can have a snack. And I said, oh, I haven't had breakfast. My teacher told my father that I had not had breakfast. The car ride back home was silent. When I got back home, he screamed at me for lying there. I had not had breakfast. That was a formative uh, <laughs> experience because it taught me that I shouldn't lie. Piano is very, uh, given my like kind of Asian Asian parent narrative. Now you would expect that my parents forced me to play the piano, but that's not true. I picked up the piano myself. Well, it's a way of dealing with emotions. I don't deal with uh, large quantities of emotions very well, so I need something to kind of. Uh, uh, offload them onto. I play. I don't play any contemporary popular nice music. I play only uh, Bach and Mozart <laughs> and boring stuff like that. Not boring to me, but like I feel like a lot of people don't really appreciate them. Um, oh, mythical free time. Um, actually, that's not a good message to send to people. You always have time. <laughs> I play Dota. <laughs> I know that this may come as a surprise to a lot of people. Because I don't look like a, someone who plays Dota. I've actually been playing a lot of Dota secretly. Uh, I like Dota because I can study it. <laughs> and it's good because it's something I can study and practice and become better if I continue to practice and study it. That Dota never makes you less stressed. It kind of just makes you more stressed, but I think it probably makes you more stressed about something else, so you don't get as stressed about what you're currently doing. So I went to um, Yale uh, for my study abroad. This small place. This small cold <laughs> place. Just don't come out from your office. Uh, I mean classroom, whatever. Uh, <laughs> no, that's a bad decision. Go to New York every weekend. Something I did that was really crazy was I drank a lot of wine all the time. Um, oh yeah, because wine was so cheap there, I bought wine all the time. And I was like feeling sad about some stuff. So like I would drink, drink like lots of wine. Ugh. It's like three dollars a bottle from that weird store. Most comfortable with English. Uh, because it's a language I use with my friends, shall we say. English is a more carefree and like less a fair language, and I am more dramatic, much more dramatic in English. I am much more expressive in English. I don't consider as carefully what words I use in English. Recently, I got more comfortable with Chinese uh, Mandarin be because I speak it with Clara sometimes now. Before that, I always associated it with my uh, family, which uh, for a number of reasons, you know, I think everyone's like kind of more uncomfortable with their family. Is that right? No, that's not right. Uh, like sometimes I associate uh, speaking Chinese with like obligation and uh, duty. And because of the requirements for me to speak Chinese in a very specific way, it's the kind of private language for me. With Clara, it's changed because Clara, Clara is like truly bilingual. You know, like she, she can switch between both like really well. <laughs> her, her standard of Chinese is probably better than mine. She's made the language more comfortable for me. So I think language is very associated with certain people for me. For a long time, it was associated with my parents, and therefore it had kind of aura of like respect and like a duty for me. But now that um, you know, I can like kind of uh, I don't know, um, just gossip about other people with like Clara using Chinese or like you know, uh, point out cute boys in Chinese or something. <laughs>